Good morning, guys. If you if this is your first time tuning in, my name is Jason. Thank you for visiting Ski Fish and Enjoy Life. We're here outside of Tackle Box uh, waiting for Phil to open. They do open up 4.30 in the morning, which makes getting bait crack of dawn nice and easy. Uh, we will be fishing Sandy Hook today, both dawn and dusk. Uh, but before we uh, start talking about that, I want to give a shout out to a couple people. My buddy Craig, uh, Craig from LBI has been killing it with bass. Here's a picture of his biggest at 44 inches. He's been using fresh clam and bunker. He's gotten multiple keepers and a few trophies like the one in the picture. Uh, second shout out, I'd like to give a shout out to subscriber Rodrigo who did get a nice keeper bass off the pier the other day on a bunker chunk, which you can see right here. And now, my featured shout out. All you guys know Dennis from uh, Eastern PA. Now, he is 75 years young and he has more energy than people half his age. He met up with some friends of his by the Atlantic City uh, Brigantine area and look at the bass he caught the other day. Forty-two inches, which I believe is his personal best, and we do have Dennis over here. He actually got here to tackle backs before I did. He's happy eating his glazed donut. So, Dennis, how'd you feel when you caught your forty-two inch bass? Oh, I was feeling great. It, ex exactly. I mean, I mean that is just downright awesome. So, all right, guys. Hey, I'm anticipating a great day today. Uh, we'll see you guys on the beach. Dennis from PA over there. We got Mike from the Delaware River over there. Subscriber David's on his way. We got perfect conditions, white water. We're in the hole that looks like the washing machine. I'm, I'm predicting some fish. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Ready. Watch my warm pole, Dave. Uh, Hooked up, De uh, dead. Lock it low, baby. On the worm. And that's a striper. Fast of the day, it was in the water for five minutes. That's why you get here early. We got here before the sun went up and we're fishing in the washing machine. All right guys, we're gonna be doing a segment here asking asking subscribers of the channel their thoughts on Hooper. Mike, the first, now you've met Hooper I think twice. The first time you met, three or four times. Like when you see him fish and when you see him in action, what are some words that come to mind? Confused. Confused, okay. Amazing. Yeah, but confused slash amazing. Exactly. Like, 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 like he, he talks like he knows exactly what he's doing, but when you're watching him, you're just like, all right. Yeah, he actually, when I first met him, seemed like that, uh, he knew exactly what he was doing. But then, but then you notice he repeats sentence fragments of what I say? Yeah. All right, good, good. Okay. Subscriber David here. So David, my question to you, I'm, I'm asking random people. Obviously you've met and you've fished with Hooper on many occasions. When you see him in action, what are some words that come to mind? <laughs> oh. I, I, we, do, we, we could do. I'm, I'm at a loss for words. Lost words. I, I mean, a ninth wonder of the modern world, amazing human, or just Hooper says it all. Dedicated to Dedica what? I don't know. He's, 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 he's dedicated to a certain cause. We just don't know what that yeah, cause we is. We just don't know what it is. Yet. Exactly. Makes sense. But trying to get Hooper here before the sun comes up is like trying to like part the Red Sea. He doesn't come in this morning. He, he does, but, I, but the fish really have to be biting, and I literally have to. Tell him twice the night before, give him a 4 a.m. wake up call, set him about eight texts telling him I know you see the phone, stop ignoring me. And if I and if I put in that effort, he actually will show up. <laughs> Dennis, I'm gonna send you just say a random word to you. Just say the first thing that comes to mind. Are you ready? Hooper. M-I-A. M-I-A, yeah, exactly. Where, where the hell Probation. is he? Probation, yes. Is that David is doing the uh Hooper fish dance? 
And I don't, I don't even want to know what Dennis is doing. <laughs> we have a real treat here. We have Hooper on the phone. He's going to be giving up his wisdom to David and Dennis. Go ahead, Hooper. You're coming here at 6 p.m. tonight to make a guest appearance. Well, I mean, I, I was doing, I was, I was literally inter interviewing people on the street. Everybody says yeah. you're their inspiration. Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> so Dennis is hooked up. Oh. Right, I'm gonna help him in a bit. My buddy Eric over there. Uh, we we are doing once again the fresh clam sandworms, and rumor has it that Hooper will be making a guest appearance in about 20 minutes. We will see. Sean. Guys, we call this the Vinny Special. And how do you catch my line? Cast to the left, the left, the left. Oh. Yes, it's very pretty. Looks like there's still a cover on one of the hooks. Now, luckily, there's five other troubles there. So, so he was using a lure. Take a look. He he didn't bother to take the cover off of one of the trebles. This is why I yell. All right, you're gonna hold this pole. I'm taking the cover off of it. Hold this pole, and then I'll rig you up. Hold this pole. I have that pole All right, all right. If you don't like Ernie, and you go by Ed. My household respect. Oh, you do. This is Hooper, by the way. He's a living legend on the Jersey Shore. Yeah, yeah, sure. All right, so what we're going to do, okay? Tell me all about it, though. You like to be called Ed. His name's Eric. Oh, Eric. All right, Hooper, I want you to hold my clam pole. I'll rig you up. All right, hey, it goes Oh. Yeah, that one. Hold that one, please. What I have to do, I have to cut Hooper's clams for him because can you explain to me why you would go fishing without a knife? I'm just curious. Uh, I have you, you don't have a knife in there. I looked through your whole bucket. Yep. You don't have a knife, okay? Okay, good, good, good. Our scissors and knife here. Here are your clams. You put two on the hook. Tell me how we catch a striper. Why are you holding my pole and why do you not have a hook? Because I'm showing you how to catch a striper. I, he literally casts it. I hear the line snap. And the first thing he does is he looks at me if I saw him. And yeah, yeah, good, yeah, good. Uh, yeah, good. Now he's going to catch a bass on my pole like he always does. This is called him kamikaze me. All right, here's your hook. Here's your wakes. I, I mean, God forbid you'd ever bring... Okay, oh, yeah, I see the sun. I, yeah, that's you changed something to camera. All right, here. Tie this on. Tie this on. Here you go. And I swear to Christ, okay, make your peace with God if you lose another one. 
try to rig up his pole is like watching man trying to invent friggin' friggin' fire. All right, well, there he goes. There he goes. You want wand light? Okay. Can you can you put the light on me so people can see me? <laughs> oh, you want this light too? No, 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 not that. That one blinds me. No. Yeah, okay. Right. Well, guys, all I gotta say is Hooper was. We Hooper, don't, Hooper. We don't always catch fish, but we have fun. We had fun. But let's talk about your day, okay? You, number one, you came with no bait. You snapped your rig. You didn't have a spare rig. You started casting a lure, and I thought number I thought you oh, were like yeah, yeah. I thought you were ballet dancing. Can you tell can you tell the audience why you're soaking wet? Come on, tell them why you're soaking wet. Ah, uh, because I went fishing. That's all part of the. Uh... You know, he's about to go down with a wave. I swear to God, he sticks the pole in the sand like he's gonna do like I... the pole vault thing. It, it was the greatest thing I've ever seen. I almost drowned. Other than that, it was a beautiful evening. <laughs> Guys, well, hey, look, we, I, I've been at it since this morning. We don't always. Two thirty in the morning. Give him credit. I, I woke There's up to heart yes. of a champion. Heart yeah. of a champion. Right yes, there. see, that's a champion right there. <laughs> yes, I, yes, I woke up. Champion, that's a champion right there. Two thirty in the morning. Hey, everybody, clap for him. Guys, okay. guys, we don't always catch quality fish, but we have a damn good time trying. So, guys, uh, I do have to work a couple days this week. Uh, we will be having an extended Memorial Day weekend on LBI. So, until the next vid, guys, please always remember, every day is a blessing. Watch Hooper very closely whenever he fishes. And don't ever forget to enjoy life.